In this sentence about anticipating microcomputer technology, the underlined section is a very long, complicated idea. So as always, it's very important to scan through the answer choices and find those words that distinguish one answer from the other. So when we look at A, what we get is that educators have not, blah, 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 whatever they have not, can hardly be said that it is their fault. That's an incredibly awkward way of saying it, that such and such has happened can hardly be said that it is their, that it is their fault. So this is very wordy and awkward, and so it's incorrect. That educators have not blah, 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 can hardly be said to be at fault. Well, the problem with this, this is, this is considerably more direct than A. The problem is, can hardly said to be at fault, that would apply to the educators, and it would work perfectly if educators were the subject of the sentence. Unfortunately, this entire clause, that educators have not blah, 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 that's the subject of the sentence. So that clause cannot be said to be at fault. That doesn't make any sense. So that's the problem with B. B is out. C arouses our suspicion right away because it begins with what's called an empty it. It can hardly be said. So it can hardly be said that it is the fault of. We have another empty it. So this is just way too complicated right here. It, it can hardly be said that it is the fault of educators who, there must be a more direct way to say it than that. That's awful. D, we also have an empty it, so it raises our suspicions. It can hardly be said that educators are not at fault for. So all of this is actually incredibly direct and concise. So that's impressive. Put that on hold, we'll go back to that. The fact that educators are at fault, blah, 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 can hardly be said. The fact that can hardly be said, way too wordy, redundant, not appropriate. So the only one that works is D. Notice that D is the shortest answer. It is sleek, direct, and powerful. It is by far the best answer choice.